Welcome back everybody to uh, Fantasy Star 2. Uh, this is episode um, 7. <laughs> I kind of forgot. Um, I think it's episode 7. Is it? Yeah, episode 7. Um, soon enough you'll see what I did off camera. Uh, but these are the people we're taking in. Uh, Blue, Rudo, Anna, and Nay. You can take a look at their levels. I'm not entirely sure. This, this place isn't too large, but it is... Well, it's large, it's just that I know where to go. Alright, let's get right into it. <clears throat> Alright, welcome. Uh, <clears throat> this is the first uh, money spent. It's not really, it hasn't been that long since I started grinding. But I thought I might as well do this to start it off. Yeah. And knife boots for Nay. Uh, we're going to start off with these two, hopefully. Well, actually her... Uh, Nay's gonna get new weapons, but, uh, I don't know if I currently have enough for it. Laser... Yeah, laser bars. Alright, I do have enough then. And we want to get both of these for Nay. Uh, this is all the equipment you want for the main two. And I recommend getting into that first, because... They'll probably be the ones you... Well, they're gonna be in your party no matter what. So it's better to have them as strong as possible. Yeah, see that? That's a 13 increase. Yeah, he didn't get really much. However, her her equipment boost should be great. A little bit more defense and attack. Well, I say a little bit, but that's quite a bit. And then knife boots. Boom, that's that's all right now. Alrighty, uh, we are back to buy some more trash gear. Alright, we're, we're starting off in Oputa. And we're here to get a fiber cape. cape. For sure. Yeah, five a cape. Sure. You can see I have a lot of money. And that is it. Next is Zima. Alright, let's start off with the weapon store. We want four of these. Yeah, laser knives. For two for Kane. Two for sure. And that's all from the weapon shop. We'll just go down to the armor shop. Yeah, these guys are having a lot of old gear. Actually, all the sure stuff is from old gear. Um, we want boots, and now we'll wrap up sure. We want also boots for Kane. And I think the only one missing is a Titan helmet for Kane. Next location is uh, Cuter. And we're here for more armor. Well, actually, we're here for one piece of armor specific specifically. No. Oh, wait, no. Yeah, titanium armor is actually what we need. Alright, anyway. Titanium armor is what we need for Kane. Wraps up these two. Let's uh, see the improvement. Uh, these guys should get a massive improvement from all this stuff. Yeah, holy shit. Alright, boots. How much is that for defense? About four, I think. There's attack up as well by one. Titan helmet, more defense, good. Titan armor. Fiber cape didn't really equip, uh, increase that much. However, her attack went really high. Um, these two are now done. I'll be back with. Well, actually, um, we're here for Rudo and Anna's gear now. Um, these two are the ones I'm picking on the journey, so they're, they're the most important ones to get armor for and shit. Uh, so, starting off with Rudo, we just want a uh, titanium armor from here. Boom. And for uh, Anna, we want knife boots and titanium cape. And that's it for now. Obviously, we're going to buy stuff later because uh, we want a laser shot for... Uh, yep, for Rudo. Just one. Because it takes up both hands. And for Anna, we want two laser slashes, I think. Let me just call the... Yeah, laser slashes. No. Boom. And that is it for them. I'm also going to sell this stuff. Oh, this is just added to his defense, but his attack remained the same. Now for Anna, her stat should have a quite good increase. Okay, not bad. Alright. Uh, we're pretty much ready for all the... Uh, we're pretty much done getting gear for everyone. Alrighty, uh, it's time for sure to do stuff. By do stuff, I mean fucking rob this place right here. So, I think the strategy is just to keep on entering and exiting. So let's just do this.
Oh. All right. It finally happened. Uh, she is now vanished. And if we return to our house... Yeah, sure is here. So we went for a little walk. Well, Blue, let's get going. So, yes, yeah, she's here, and she should have the visor phone. Now, if we use it, contact with the data memory, you can now save your game at any point in the story. Very easy to use, so... I uh, will give it back to Blue, because he's going to be on our party, guaranteed. Do not hand it to uh, Nay. Bad option there. Alrighty, also, this music here is really good. I think this dungeon has pretty good music. Anyway, uh, we want to go to the, we want to go all the way to the right over here to the staircase. I think these guys are new. Not really sure. I. I don't remember what enemies I've faced in camera. I'm pretty sure those guys don't know that. Catmans. Alrighty. No, we want to go all the way to the left. Sorry, I already forgot where to go. I... Okay, whatever. And then there. Smash away at our enemies. Anyway. Uh, um... Then we're going to go left and down the stairs. Down these stairs. Then left. Up. Then all the way to the left, I believe. Yeah, here. Um... Okay, I actually yeah, I got that wrong. It's down. It's, we want to go right from here, uh, and then down, and then down again, then across, and then I think we go up. Yeah, there's a cave entrance there, and I don't think there's anything over here. All right, time to just heal up. All right, now let's go to the cave entrance. And we want to go right, up, right upstairs. All right, more. All right, more. Up the stairs again. And then I think we want to go right upstairs again. There'll be a cave entrance to our left, but we're going to ignore that. I think we go right from here. Alrighty, um, yeah, walk the way down, down the stairs, and then we want to go walk right again, and then downstairs, and we kind of just follow this pattern for a little bit. That's a long ride, um. <laughs> and boom, inside. Um, yeah, we want to go left from here. Up. And I think it's this tree. I, I don't know if you guys remember why we came here. This is it. This is the more, the more, that tree. Uh, we got the leaf for it. Uh, now we need to go back to the professor and um, Cutie. So let's do that real quick. So yeah, like I said, it's a, it is a maze in there, but luckily I've walked through and I've gone through there before, so you know it's fine. Alrighty, uh, let's return to the professor. Uh, and and give him that uh, mirror, I love leaf. Also, I didn't actually train in the cave, I trained out here. Uh, because everyone's pretty weak right now. Alright, anyway. Yeah, okay, I was about to say, is this the right place? But yes, it is. Yeah, I mean, it is. Alright, I'm gonna go down here. You guys remember the river priest there is, eh? Well, if you don't, he's all the way down here. Try not to accidentally leave so that you don't have to do this all again. Alrighty, in here. Hi, I'm working on a new kind of invention. That's it. I'm here. How do you say that? Please give it to me. Yes. Thanks. If you add, I'll make the gum. Done. There's plenty here. Go take. So take some. There you go. Farewell. Yeah. Um. So anyway, 
Let's see how how much there's just one. Did he give it to everyone in the party? Is that it? No. Okay, so he gave us one. Okay, we're just gonna assume that gives everyone the immunity. The immunity. All right. <clears throat> Alrighty, hello everyone. Uh, we're here to buy more equipment before we continue on with episode seven. Um, so we're just gonna go out the main floor because, well. Uh, I don't. I need a. I need probably at least an extra zero on the end for me to buy everything. So you know, one in the front. Um. All right. Anyway, you want jewel ribbon for the uh, for Nay. You want ceramic chest for um, blue. And you want ceramic armor for Rudo. And for Anna, you want the ceramic cape. I think this is hopefully this is the right gear I'm buying. And uh, what was the last one? Silver crown. Uh, it's really cheap, so. Alright, um, I think that's it for those four here. Um, yep. Alright, let's head over to the weapon shop. Alrighty, we're at the weapon shop. So for Rudo, we want the laser sword. Yeah, that is the right one. Uh, laser cannon for Rudo. Oh, shit. <laughs> I don't have enough money. Alright, let's go back to and get that laser cannon for Rudo. I really hate how it cancels you out of the shop just because you don't want to buy one specific item. Well, I don't actually know what that does. Um, anyway, laser cannon for Rudo, and we're, we're done here. That's a lot of money. We're going to stock up on dynamites and shit if we don't already have some. But to be fair, we got four right now. And then we'll buy, we'll buy some trimites. Because we have enough of that. Wait, this is the right town, right? I, I believe so. There we go, northwest corner. Very isolated. Yeah, I didn't realize this when I was going through here before. Uh, so I could actually talk to all these people. People at Algo are hungry all the time because they can't eat anything. Those two I can't really. I, I, I don't care anymore, okay? This is a bit late. Uh, a musician, do you want to hear me play? No. Yeah, you want to learn how to play the piano? Yes. Am I a great musician or what? Uh, a musician? Yeah. Totally. Blue. I'm going to give it to him because he's our main character, so he'll always be in the party, no matter what. And I'm pretty sure... Um... Funny, funny. Well, let's... Yeah. Ah, oh, okay. Music technique. I think that is useful for some things in the game. I don't know when, so... That's why, actually, I'm kind of busy. Okay. Totally. I, I don't want to hear you play. Yes. We totally want to learn. Yes. No. No. 5,000. And that's like it for... every female. 5,000! I need to not press circle because of... Yeah. So, pretty much, he's... Yeah. Like, I give Rudo 2,000. Yeah, see, for some reason, he, he makes it so the woman has to pay more. You have to pay more for the woman to learn for some reason. Um, he's a bit weird like that. I don't know why they made this into the game, but okay. Um, I don't know when we need to use that ability, but I decided to get it now because we... I keep on forgetting how to get there. All right, so this is Uzo Island. We want to go over here, and then and then we want to go to this stupid island and then south. And this little thing here, I actually didn't realize this is the place we needed to go before. So, uh, yeah, and we're gonna use the mirror gum, whatever. To buy it, eat, which each bite 
everyone's balance feels a beer, could help underwater. There we go. And we're into the final dungeon of the game. Alright, let's just quickly save my game. And then we'll get on with the dungeon. Welcome to Climate. Wait. Yeah, C Climate Troll. <clears throat> anyway. Ooh. Let's go. West. And then when it branches off to the south, we're going to go down here. That ends a blocked up corner, so we're going to go this way. Ooh. And now we want to go northwest. This dungeon has, I think, eight floors, which is a lot. Um, anyway, now we come up to another split path. Uh, we want to go north. We just want to keep really going north, north, north. And, well, actually, no. Well, it, it's it's basically north for a while here, and then, yeah, you can also bypass these little damage zones. And then you want to go to south from here. Yeah, so south from here. You know. And then we'll get to a staircase, which leads to floor two. I, I mean, floor one. Alright, this one's pretty simple. We just want to go uh, south. Uh, this is a really narrow thing. It's it's pretty much west until we hit the wall. All these paths, I'm pretty sure, lead to nothing. If they if they do lead to something, it's shoot that leads back down to level one. I mean zero. Um, and then west again, I believe. And then west, uh, which will lead to a shoot, I believe. Yep. Second floor. Here we go. Alright, anyway, we just want to walk east from here. This floor is just one big square, and we're going to take the chute here. There's nothing here. Um, yeah, we want to go south side for the chest, and then we're going to go back up north, or whatever. We got the jewel ribbon, we could put that. We could have gotten this from here, but whatever, it doesn't matter. And then we go north, and take this chute. Did I mention this was full three? Right, hopefully I did. Anyway, we're going full four. Alright, now we're going to go to the south side, because there's another chest, I believe. Uh, yep. And there's a chute that we will be taking, by the way. Uh, this contains a fiber, fiber vest. Chute. Alright, this one's, uh, this is for floor five, where things get actually difficult, because there's three different pathways we can go. Well, to get treasures, at least. Anyway, uh, we're going to go northeast first. Now, this one I got confused when I was first doing it, and I, I still am a bit confused, but I believe it's this path down here that we want to go. There are new enemies, but I'm just going to probably cut them out. They're all pretty much just repeats of what we've already seen. Anyway, north, northeast all the way here to shoot, and we're going to take it. Alrighty. And then we south to the next shoot over here obviously don't fall in the pit of darkness south from here is sandals yep and then we're gonna go south continue south and then go right uh yeah we want to ignore that shoot and go to this one all right anyway there's uh i think two shoots right here but we don't want to go through either of them we want to go to the one over there Yeah. Alright, now north, follow the path pretty much. To the shoot. Alright, now west. An open area should appear. Well, should happen. And then southwest. So this. I th think it's this shoot? I don't know, there's a, there's a lot of stuff in here. Alright, um, go back down, yeah, walk right, and then south to find a laser bar, yeah, I'm going the right way. I just had to check that, because this place is very confusing. Oh, Rudo has now got it, okay. Um, yeah, then we want to go, 
You just want to head back here and then west to find a shoot leading. I think it's this. Yeah, yeah, this is it. This is it. All right. And then we're going to go south. Uh, ignoring that for now. We need to go... Oh, uh, yeah, there's this little pathway here, which leads to another chest. With knife boots. And now we head back. And... And we're going to take this floor. Now we want to go this chute. And then we go south. Take that chute, obviously. And then southeast from here. And we take the chute. And now I believe we're back in floor 5. Yep, this is floor 5 still. Alright. And that was trip 1. Alright. Let's, uh, curl up and be back. Alright. That was the most, most of the treasures. Anyway, we're gonna go southwest. Uh, the furthest southwest we could possibly go. Um, I think I might have gone the wrong way. Okay, never mind. Okay, good. We want to ignore that shoot there. We want to go far, 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 right to this one. All right. East. Um, there's both these. Sh well, this bottom one leads down. This top one leads up. We want to take the up one, obviously. And then we're going to head west. And then follow the corridor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ceramic bar. Yeah, and then that's it. That's it for trip two, really. Just head back to the chute. Uh, down these stairs. And return to the center. Uh, you know, if I can find that center again. Alright. Yeah, we're here. Now it's trip two. Um, now is probably the time to go back and heal up. However, I'm not going to do that. I'll, I'll do that at the end of the video. Because uh, there is uh, our first boss arriving. So let's do trip three now. Alright. So now we want to go northwest. Northwest corner. At not far northwest corner. Uh, we're gonna take the one in the center, pretty much. This is like in the middle of the room, but it's all the way in the north. It's secluded, obviously. Alrighty. <sighs> uh, yeah, and then we're gonna go to the shoot right next to us. Walk south. Follow the thing. Yeah, and then we're gonna hit south, and we should. Find another shoot, yeah. Alrighty, then we want to head west. And we'll find another chest. I th think this is the last one in the game. Not in, in this area, I mean. Alright, and then we want to ignore the shoot. And we walk south on the other side. Down to the shoot. Alright. And then we're going to just head west to reach a chute again, which will lead up to floor 8. But Alrighty, and then we're going to head east, and this is the top floor, so woohoo. And it's, a, it's got five different pathways, we want to take the middle one. I don't actually think it matters, I think the... Yeah, you can also take the... Yeah. And then north. See, I already got a different variant of an enemy I've already faced in this area. And it's just orange instead of red. And in this little area, we have a suspicious individual. Uh, the, I don't really like the blue. It kind of looks uh, off. But yeah, if you look at her and then you look at Nay, uh, they look kind of similar, eh? Almost like the twins or something, eh? Anyway, uh, that is, you know, the end of this video. I'm going to go back to town and rest up before I do this, and also end the video. Uh, this was episode 7. Oh, it's been a l it's been, uh, this has been recorded over like three days. This is how long it's been taking. 
Um, yeah, but this is episode 7. Hope you guys all enjoy it. And next time we'll uh, find out who this person is. And also I'm going to rest up at uh, the end back in town before coming back here. Bye-bye.